Perry's breakup with her billionaire ex-fiance now, James Packer. So apparently the two had some differences. I mean, it looks like James Packer didn't really realize that Mariah Carey was a diva. It seems like he's tired of her spending money and being lavish, but everyone knew Mar Mariah Carey was a diva from the front, from the get-go. But what it looks like happening now is that Mariah Carey is asking him to pay her $50 million. So it looks like she's asking for this money because he inconvenienced her. So according to TMZ, Sources connected to the now warring ex-couple say that Mariah believes Jane, James has cost her tens of millions of dollars because one, she claims he got her to move from New York to LA, uprooting her entire life so he could be near his kids. And then she also claims that the incident on the yacht in Greece where she said he did something awful to her assistant has traumatized Mariah so much that she had to cancel the South American leg of her tour. And apparently he also made other financial promises to her. So I don't know if you guys know, but also the engagement ring that she got is worth $10 million. So I've seen a lot of debate online as to whether she should return the ring to James Packer or keep it and pawn it. But Mariah Carey herself is worth millions of dollars. So should she really keep it? Should she give it back to James Packer? I mean, either way, it seems like a messy situation. Mariah is saying that, you know, he was unstable, all this stuff. And, you know, they seem pretty lovey-dovey before, but it looks like maybe James is a little aggressive. But also, well, James should have knew that Mariah Carey is a diva because everyone knew that. And I guess I also read online that Mariah Carey and him or maybe it was with Mariah Carey's rule, but they haven't had sex at all. I mean, they don't believe, or she doesn't believe in premarital sex. So I guess all this time they've been dating, she never gave him any, he never got any. I don't know how that works. I mean, this dude looks like he's in his 50s or whatever. So I don't know how a guy his age is going that long, but it looks like Mariah Carey also did that with Nick Cannon. So it's nothing new. And actually, I don't even know if Mariah Carey is officially divorced from Nick Cannon yet. I mean, from what I see on like the Wendy Williams show, she usually addresses the Mar Mariah Carey situation. It doesn't look like their divorce is even finalized. So she was basically engaged to this other guy. And meanwhile, she's still legally married to Nick Cannon. So the whole situation was messy. But also Wendy Williams predicted that they weren't gonna make it down the aisle. And, you know, it's sad to say that her prediction is coming true and looks like Mariah's on her own now. Um, it looks like Mariah just needs someone at her caliber, someone who not necessarily worships her, but is okay with, like, the lifestyle she lives. I mean, Mariah Carey seems like she's someone who enjoys, like, the finer things in life, is very glamorous. Maybe James was like, okay, he thought it was cute at first. Now he's like, why are you spending all my money or something like that? But anyway, the situation is just getting kind of messy. I mean, I don't know what James did to her assistant on that yacht in Greece. If he yelled at her, if he put his hands on her, but it was so bad that Mariah canceled the rest of her tour and actually flew back to LA, I believe. So it's gonna be interesting to see what happens afterward. Doesn't look like the judge is giving her $50 million for I guess this inconvenience that James caused her because honestly, a lot of us have exes and well, if we could get a million or even 50 million for every ex that we had that inconvenienced us, we'd all be millionaires. I mean, that's honestly rich people problem. Whether or not she returns the ring, I mean, she's still gonna be wealthy, but I think it'll really hit him where it hurts if she returned that beautiful $10 million ring. I don't know what's gonna happen, but I wish you the best of luck, Mariah Carey. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel and feel free to comment below what you thought about this video.